Yeah, you know, uh, I read in this uh in this white paper that Citibank wrote, okay, back in 20, 2018, right? Citibank, that Citibank, right? right? So I think it's very interesting because uh, in that article, in, it's, it's a very, it's, it's a super long article, right? hundreds of pages, okay, it's, it's more like a white paper, right, from, from Citibank that talks yeah. about the future of assets, right? right? Yeah. So the future of technology, according to Citibank, which actually we can start to smell certain signs of it, right? Is that once you buy, rather than just one person owning one, heavy big asset right let's say your house costs a million dollars usd now you can fractionalize it right think of it like a like a like a really big pizza right think of it uh, like a really big pizza they can slice it into many pieces and everyone can right. buy one piece of the pie yes, right yeah, yeah. so I, I found that very interesting because you know usually people think that uh like, like what you have mentioned rightly so right like nfts are just this hypey thing that that people mm. buy into and stuff like that but you know on the back end there's so much real things going on like the big banks like Citibank, you know, the, the really big banks who have the, the, the financial muscles and the influence, right? Building technologies on the back end that we probably don't even, that pro- probably regular consumers don't even know yet, right? But they're already, yeah. they're already building stuff to, you know, cut the houses into pizza slices, letting, letting their own investors, their private investors probably to own a piece of it, right? And from then, you know, you probably have derivative products, right? Like you can just bundle it up, put it into like fund that invest in like maybe like 10,000 fractionalized real estate right so it's, it's just so amazing right there's so many things that people can do right like it's sharing economy on steroids we call it 